Reveal. This is Bobby Yan, film director, and uh, this is GoldenMediaTV.com. Check it out. Ladies and gentlemen, Mobile Media TV, we have Bree Beauty. How are you? I'm doing good. Yourself? Busy. We shoot 24 7. It's about 1 30 right now. Definitely. Grand is grand. It's the only way we'll make it. Let people know where you're from. I'm from Queens, Jamaica, Queens. Um, born and raised in Queens. I live in Long Island City. Now I'm in Jamaica, Queens. South Side. I'm with a great city. I don't really know. Now, how did you get started with your career? Well, it started from when I was very young. I did a lot of talent shows. I was to all types of competitions, singing, rapping, dancing. But it really got serious in, uh, how old was I? I was like 12 years old. I was working with Bars and Hooks, um, Bravehearts. Um, I don't know if y'all know him, but not. He used to have a group called the Bravehearts with his brother, John Boy. He did the Uchi Wally song. After not, I left them alone. I started working with them. Things didn't really work out, so moved on. Started going all along that DJ website. Things just started going crazy from there. Now, last year you did a duet with Jim Jones. How did that happen? Oh, that happened because Webstar, he had to dance on me song with Jim Jones. And when they was in the studio, Jim Jones was like, yo, I need the girl for 5000 I don't want to do my hook. And I was like, oh, like, you know, I went down to the studio, and it was working, and I, I listened to the vibe. I'm like, oh, right, I started writing, did the hook, for it amazed me. Has your life changed since you did that duet with Jim Jones? Honestly, my life changed when I did the 5,000. It got a little crazy when I did the nana nana -na -na, but when I did the 5,000, it definitely changed. Like, everybody running up to me, oh, free. Like, I can't do all the regular stuff I was doing. I still am very humble, you know. I, I still live my regular life. People come to me, they come to me, I sign with you, you know. Is there some places where you can't go? Hmm. I can't go in front of a school where they're getting let out. I can't. I can't. Not. Junior high school or high school. Now since that's happened, what's next for Brie Beauty? Well, in case y'all didn't know, I'm going down to ATL to do some work out there. I got hooked up, um, definitely having a connection with Hip Hop since 1978, product manager, Drake, Lil Wayne, um, a couple of people, Kanye West, he does a lot. Um, he connected me with some people out there in ATL, going out there to work. This Thursday, and then I'm going to Miami, and I'm just going to work it out there. Got to leave New York, go see, get this money. What are some of the keys to you being a successful artist? Triple H, stay hungry, humble, and honest. And where the fans could talk to you at? You can reach me at twitter.com slash breedbeauty, myspace.com slash MS Miss Free Beauty and Facebook.com slash Free Beauty and my Free Beauty is spelled B R I Beauty. It's not B R E E. I know some people got that mistake from MTV, but it's B R I Beauty. I'm sure you're not spelled Beauty. <laughs> Who are some of your role models? Definitely Lauren Hill, definitely Whitney Houston, and I idolize Beyonce. Who's you like to work with in the near future? Definitely want to work with Jay Z. Um, who else would I want to work with? Far as females, I definitely would like to do a song with Monica. She's one of my all time favorites. And, I don't know. Who else? I mean, that's mainly it. Like, far as who I got my mind set, looking forward to what I want like to do. Yeah, Jay Z and Monica. What do you feel about female rappers right now in this present day? I feel that it's, it's, it's good, it's great that there's a lot of female um, rappers that's coming out now. Just a while ago it was like there were none 
and right now it looks like it's only Nicki Minaj, but there's a whole lot of underground young ladies that's out there doing their thing and they going hard. And I thank Nicki Minaj because if it wasn't for her, it probably wouldn't be a lot of girls that's going so hard right now to be a female rapper. For me, I don't consider myself as a female rapper. I'm all about artists. Do you play an instrument? No, not right now. I'm um, actually working on learning how to play the guitar. Yeah, so I'm getting the hang of that pretty soon. I'll be good. <laughs> That's another check. You already know. <laughs> Do you have time for a private life? Of course. I have time for a private life, but me, I'm the type of person where I'm all about my business. I'm all about money and I'm all about my music. And if it has nothing to do with that, I don't really engage in it. Besides my family, my family um, support me, everything I do, so that's what my life is basically based on. Music. So no boyfriend today? No, no boyfriend. Not right now. Just focus on my music. In the future. Yeah. Is there anything you want to tell us that the fans don't know about you? I love everybody. Some people think I'm cocky. I'm very far from cocky. And look out for me because I'm coming in very, very soon. <laughs> and are you working on an album right now? Yes, that's what I'm going into. I'm definitely working on it. a major label driver distributing yourself. I would like to be signed to a major label. I mean, either one is good for you. I feel like I'm going to get far. Either way I go, I'm going to get far. But I would like a major little to yes, definitely. Is there anything you want to say about? Um, all my young people out there, stay in school. All my female rap out there, keep doing your thing. All my sign artists, keep going hard, keep grinding, never give up. It's our turn in 2010, y'all already know. Should be a preview here.